weeks. He has the bite marks to show. A four pierce teenager out of the hospital. Those injuries are from a shark. He says he was bitten while surfing. News Channel 5's Andrew Lafholm just spoke with the surfer. He is at Lawnwood Regional Medical Center with our story. Andrew? Guys, about 24 hours after being bit by a shark, he was able to walk out of the hospital here. Now, while his arm is bandaged up a little bit, overall, he's in great spirits to get this. He can't wait to get back out on the water again. I have one big one right here, which is like pretty deep, and I got one pretty good sized one right here. This is Zach Davis's right arm underneath the bandage. The 16 year old avid surfer was catching waves at Avalon Park Beach Tuesday afternoon. I was on a wave, and like one part of the wave like closed out. And like that, like took me underwater. And like when I was underwater, I just got like hit right here, like by a shark. It just like held on for like two or three seconds. He used his surfboard cord as a temporary tourniquet and ran to his nearby home to get help from his mom. I just said like before I show you, like don't freak out or anything. But like I got bit by a shark. And he was rushed to Lawnwood in an ambulance. Just before five tonight, he was released under his own power and shirtless, just like he came in. When do you expect to get back on the water? Uh, as soon as I can, honestly, like, I'm not going to just, like, not do it anymore because, like, yeah, I'll do it as soon as I am allowed to. Now, it'll be a little while before that happens. First, the stitches have to come out. That'll take about 10 to 12 days. And then the arm has to feel holy, uh, uh, heal fully. And then uh, he says on a scale from 1 to 10 pain-wise, he's at about a level 6. Live in Fort Pierce, Andrew Lawfum, WPTV News Channel 5.